And away from that story, celebrations of achievements and long-term employees was the order of the day during the Nigerian Maritime Administration and Safety Agency, NIMASA 2019 Stakeholders Awards Dinner. Our correspondent, Adebanke Odunihi, has the details. It was all glitz and glamour as the Nigerian Maritime Administration and Safety Agency, NIMASA, celebrated its 2019 awards dinner in Lagos, Nigeria. In his usual style, the Minister of Transportation, Rotimi Ameji, the host of the event, gave a very short welcome. The event was graced by the presence of dignitaries, such as the Governor of Lagos State, Babajide Sonwolu, former Governor of River State, Donald Duke, and many more. Boss Mustafa, the Secretary to the Government of the Federation, spoke on the essence of this year's event and reiterated his support for the Nigerian maritime industry. We are gathered here today to recognize some of those that contributed to the improvement of our business environment. Even though I am mindful of the fact that there is still a long way to go, we must recognize the progress we have collectively made so far. Please be rest assured that this government will continue to support the maritime industry and the shipping sector. In his welcome speech, the Director General of the agency, Dakuku Peter Said, reeled out some of the achievements of NIMASA. In the past three years, we have now number one in port states control in West and Central Africa. In the past one year, we have reduced the time for the issuance of sending clearance from 14 days to 24 hours. Our processes in Dimasa are now digitalized. We impact on digital strategy reforms. For the first time in our history, we have placed 7,000 Nigerians on board capital vessels in one year. For the first time in our history. He also gave an insight to the agency's plan for the new decade. The new decade, Nigeria will take our rightful place in the Committee of Maritime Nations. We will create limitless opportunities for our people. We will indeed become the hub of the global maritime industry as far as Africa is concerned. One of the event's objectives was to honor the employees that have worked in the agency for 15, 25 and 30 years with awards. Some of the recipients of the awards gave insight to what made them stay for so long in the agency and notable changes that had occurred over time. The passion to develop our industry, you know, for the future generation has been what has kept me all this while, giving my best. And then I will also say that we had the best crop of Nigerians, well-trained, educated in the industry, and they are passionate. I use staff welfare as a point of contact. Before now, this issue staff stagnated on a particular promotion, on a particular grade level for 15 to 10 years. So they instituted that policy that every year there must be a written examination to enable you crossover. The effort of the Nigerian Maritime Administration and Safety Agency, NIMASA, have indeed taken the Nigerian maritime industry to a higher level. More is, however, expected to be seen in the new year. Reporting for Plus TV Africa, Adebanke Odunui.